G'day everyone, Giant Munchie here for Metal Roos and today I've got with me Ocean Sleeper. How are you today, gentlemen? Fantastic. Oh, great. Oh, great. Fantastic. How are you feeling today? You played good things yesterday. How was the atmosphere? It's a, it's a, it's a little bit, and I'm going to use the word, moist in yeah. Sydney. It is, it is quite humid right now, but yeah. yesterday in Melbourne it was almost similar because it was stormy, but then it pretty well cleared up perfectly for our set and we had a really, really good set, so I haven't got sunburnt, so, yeah. <laughs> Haven't got sunburnt yet, you still got Brisbane to go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'll be fried. Yeah. Right? Yeah. yeah, if you're watching this and you're not from Australia, we don't have an ozone layer above us. So uh, <laughs> the second we step outside, just fried. Uh, as a ginger like me, we're an endangered species. But <laughs> how's it been? 2023 has been a big year for you boys. It's yeah. uh, especially kind of coming off the pandemic where everything kind of went to a halt. Now it seems like the ball's rolling again. You guys have really blown up. Definitely. Um, yeah, take it. <laughs> um, yeah, we've had a really, really good year. Um, we started with two with Make Them Suffer and um, Fit for an Autopsy, which was sick. We're um, yeah, very lucky to get on that. Then we had some uh, headline tours that sold out really quick, which was awesome. And yeah, supported Sun Clotto, which was very cool. And yeah, now this. So, and then a Thornhill show to come in two weeks. So yeah, a lot going on, which is good. Yep. So you definitely, you definitely wouldn't say you're bored at the moment. No, quite the opposite. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what would be a big highlight of the year for you so far? I know we're December. Good things are kind of like capping off the festivals. Uh, but you got any? Even if it's a bit weird, you got anything? Uh, definitely maybe? yesterday. Yeah? Yesterday was a massive highlight. It was yeah, a very, very cool set. Is this is this your first big like um, open like open air yeah. festival as well? Yeah, well? We've we've done some unified gatherings and all that, but like the capacity of this is just. You know, insane. It's the biggest festival in Australia you can play, so yeah, yeah very cool. I know, 30,000 people mm. all coming out, you get to see, it'd be hard not to have like the energy just to go out there and play like the best fucking show you ever could, Exactly, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah no, it's been, yeah, it's been great, it's been a great experience. It's catering, like all that stuff, it's going to be sad to not have this again for a while. <laughs> <laughs> Try and jump on them all the time. So anytime a festival comes up, just go, yeah, we're on, we're on. Hands yeah, up, hands I'll just up, sneak hands up. Sneak in from now on into the artist area. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, oh yeah, I know Bill in the back, and yeah, oh, yeah, you get in that way. What do you got coming up in 2024? We got any uh, new music on the horizon? Anything yeah. kind of hidden there? Yeah, we we definitely got some new music coming, probably quite soon, really. Like probably end of January, February kind of mark, and then oh. which will have an EP following and yeah, headline tour. But yeah. And then some other things that we're working out, so just, yeah, leaving Australia properly, which will be very cool. So, yeah, just trying to line all those things up. Yeah. And how's it go doing these international shows as well and then coming back to Australia? Because, uh, to put it mildly, we're a bit of a rowdy bunch down here. <laughs> <laughs> How are you finding the other crowds when you are going out there and venturing out? Uh, well, when we were in Taiwan, like, that was the first time I we went overseas and it was a really, really cool experience because, you know, English isn't the first language, but there was people singing along and all that, but they were like, I don't know, they just really looked after us, like, it was crazy, but coming back to Australia, like, I don't know, playing home's always great. Yeah. Mm. yeah. And you can't beat that home cook, uh home cooked meal either yeah. Yeah. <laughs> or a meat pie from the 7-Eleven yeah, whatever. don't have those overseas <laughs> whatever floats your boat but boys there's so many bands here playing today if you uh, if you had the chance to work with any of them like do a collab who would you pick one each one each yeah one, one each, each. alright I'm going to go the Plot and You because they are amazing yeah yeah collab well yeah Plot and You would be incredible I'm just going to go Slaughter to Frail because that would be pretty funny that would be nice <laughs> Get Alex terrible at the yeah, end of one yeah. of those tracks. That uh, definitely be very interesting. Who are you who are you keen to check out today as well? There's it's a, it's a big mix. Like yeah. uh, it's definitely not your typical festival. It's sort of hard to check out a lot of bands when you got to like run around do all the, do all the talk to do. losers yeah. like me. <laughs> <laughs> but we, like we listened to Plot New like while we just got here, which sounded great. We watched them yesterday; they were great. We're gonna try and check out Stan Atlantic soon. Um, I would like to see Slaughter to Prevail, make them suffer. I'd like to check out. And, and then we f actually, yeah, we fly out pretty much as soon as we finish today, so we don't really get a chance to do a whole lot today. Yeah. Mm. I heard there's a, there's been a bit of issues with flights and everything, the big yeah. electric cowboy fiasco that happened getting them to Sydney. Did yeah. you hear about that? Yeah, the... yeah private jet <laughs> business, yeah. Oh, tough life for them, I guess, isn't it? <laughs> must, must, must be nice. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, boys, thank you so much for coming around here today. I won't hold you up too much. There's a lot of good stuff going around. But is there any anything you wanted to say to the people out there who may may not have heard you before and why they should kind of check you out at these shows that are coming up? Um, well, we've got our new song Heaven that we just put out last week. Um, if you haven't heard it, check that out. Uh, yeah, we really like that song. It's a lot of fun. Tried to, even with our live shows, they're a lot of fun. So I think that song is a good representation of that. 
If you haven't heard Heaven, go stream it. Go to YouTube right now and watch it. Come to our next shows next year and make them the best fucking ever. Thank you. Well, you heard it from him yourself, so you better go check that out right now. I'll leave some links in the comments below so you don't have any excuses because I know people like excuses, but for that, thank you, boys. Thank, thank you, you very much. You have a great Pleasure. set. I'm looking forward thank to you. it. Thank you.